everyone! Today is a new day of a new week and that means it's time for your daily announcement. Today is Monday, September 14, 2020. We have a few announcements today. First, Happy Grandparents Day to all our beloved grandparents. Although yesterday was the official day for grandparents, here in ISYC, we will be celebrating our Grandparents Day on September 26, 2020. So please save the date for Sayawan at Kantahan sa Araw ni na Lolo at Lola. Our watch party will begin at 10 o'clock in the morning. The link to our special presentation will be posted in your Google Classroom. Next, we would like to remind everyone about the documentation guidelines for our online grandparents' day. For the dance video, it should be recorded with the landscape orientation showing the full body of your child in costume preferably with a plain background. Please record with the full song and without edits. For the community song video, it should also be recorded in landscape orientation. This time, only half of your child's body should be seen, still in costume and preferably in plain background. Please record with the full song and without edits. For the photo with gift, please take a picture with landscape orientation Half body shot with your child holding the gift at his or her chest level. Here are some helpful tips. If you have a tripod or stand, please use one. Watch the teacher's video on a different device so your child can dance along with the teacher while being recorded using another device. Do not worry about the music quality as the video editors will attach the clearer music file in the final edits. I know these tasks may be overwhelming for some of you, but we hope that you can help us in making sure that this event will be very special for our dear grandparents. Again, thank you very much for your usual support and cooperation. For our birthday celebrants, belated happy birthday to Kiefer Laino, who celebrated his birthday last September 12th. We hope you enjoyed your birthday weekend. Today, our birthday celebrants are Aria Artajos and Cheska Cuenca. Happy, happy birthday, Aria and Cheska. May all your dreams come true. Again, happy, happy birthday to all of you. Let's take a break from our usual joke of the day. This week will feature a series of Aesop's fables. Do you know what a fable is? Fables are stories that use animals as characters and provide a lesson. Today, we'll listen to the story of the lion and the mouse and find out what the moral of the story is. Are you ready? Let's begin. The Lion and the Mouse An Aesop's Fable One day, a mighty lion, tired from hunting all morning, lay down to take a nap under a large, shady tree. Some mice that lived at the foot of the tree scrambled over the sleeping lion to return to their home. But just as the last mouse was crawling over him, the lion woke up. The lion laid his big paw on the little mouse, trapping him. The mouse was very afraid. He apologized to the lion for disturbing him and begged him to spare his life and let him go. The lion pitied the little mouse, so he lifted his paw and set the mouse free. Some time later, the lion was walking near the mouse's home. The lion accidentally stepped on a trap set by a hunter, and a net made of thick ropes captured the lion and pulled him up into a tree. The lion struggled to free himself, but could not. His angry roars rumbled through the forest as he became upset and afraid. The mouse heard the lion's cries. Remembering the lion's kindness, the mouse ran to the tree and climbed up to the trap. He used his sharp little mouse teeth to gnaw through the thick ropes and set the lion free. The lion and the mouse were friends forever after. Both of them had learned that it is good to help someone who has helped you. Moral of the story, 
Good deeds are rewarded. The end. So you see, children, good deeds are always rewarded, and kindness is never wasted. With 102 days left before Christmas, one act of kindness that you can do today is simply smile. Smiling is easy and happiness is contagious. Thank you once again for watching our daily announcement. This has been Teacher Michelle and I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye!